<laughs> hey guys, okay, so it's time to robot magic, bam, and this video is pretty much just a video to say that you're beautiful, okay, um, here lately, I've been seeing a lot of things all over the internet about, like, makeup, and, oh, this celebrity's too skinny, or too skinny, and this celebrity's too big, and, you know, it's just, it's, it's ridiculous. It really is. Um, I know that me, personally, I'm happy with my body. You know, I'm not skinny, but I'm not fat. You know, I'm healthy. And I think that, you know, as an independent woman, I think that women have the right to love their bodies, whether they want to be... 105 pounds or 150 pounds you know they have the right to love their bodies um and we don't need the media telling us you're too skinny you're too fat because nobody understands how big of a step it takes to love our body when we do weigh for example like 152 pounds or 125 pounds you know no one understands how much courage and strength and confidence, God, the confidence that takes. And you know, the smallest things can just shoot it down. And it hurts. It really does. So, um, you know, I just wanted to tell you something. Um, you're beautiful, you know? You are. You're really beautiful. And I know it's hard to believe it, but I've been hearing, oh, also, like, I've been hearing about all the teenagers and stuff. And kids mostly just whoever you know just killing themselves because of being bullied well being bullied it's it's stupid i mean usually what the person's being bullied about cuts deeper or goes deeper down than you think than you'll ever know like to me I like to wear cat, cat ears. So, what? That, you know, that's me. I don't, I don't care, but I get a lot of crap for that. You know, I like that, to dye my hair a lot. I get a lot of crap for that, too. And, you know, we sh as women, you know, we shouldn't have to fry our hair to straighten it. You know, I haven't. This is, this is me. No makeup, no hair, you know, it's just Ew. <laughs> but this is me. And I'm comfortable. As Ellen DeGeneres once said, you know, people's things change. People's minds change. And you should just be alive to see it. You, you should. Um, also, Um, we shouldn't have to hide behind makeup and stuff just to feel a little, a little decent and secure with ourselves. I mean, I go to school all the time with my hair looking a mess and no makeup because I'm happy with myself. Because I ignore media. I ignore the people at school that tell me I should look ugly or pretty, sorry, and that I should cake on the makeup and fry my hair just to get it straight. No. I don't listen to you. Not anymore. You don't control my life. Mm mm. You know. I think we should just all maybe just open our eyes and realize that what we say cuts so much deeper into people than we think it does. You know what I'm saying? Like, just it's ridiculous. If everyone could just look at someone else and just say, you're beautiful, just do that. Like, the next person you can see, even if you don't know them, even if you're walking down the street and it's a complete, total stranger, just tell them, you know, you're beautiful and I love you. Because as much as you think the girl that's always happy and always smiling and has the most friends and the nicest clothes and the nicest house and the nicest cars 
is happy. She's really not, guys. The same with the boys, you know? Like, the boys at school tend to put off this huge macho guy thing. Just like with the hair and the makeup for us girls. The clothes and the cologne and the body spray. and It's ridiculous, you know? We should just accept each other. We really should. Um... Just... You're beautiful. <laughs> and I hope you never forget that. Because you are amazing. I love you. So, cheer up and... So... <laughs> because you never know who's falling in love with your smile. And personally... Smiling is a lot more attractive than frowning. Because see... They're so attractive. Mm mm. But a smile is. So, smile, take off the makeup, pull down your hair, stop straightening it, and just be happy.